previously. What oh shit. The? And so we go. Hello friends, my name is Ronnie, and welcome back to Bear With Me. We are at the East Tunnel outside of Flint's Realm. Um, so yeah. Let's, is my camera doing a thing? No, it's not. Okay. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna look at the bush. CG said I should go down the tunnel. What does the bush have to do with that? It differentiates between the gray one and the slightly less gray one. Yeah, as long as you know that it's a gray world. CBG. Okay, okay. Uh... Seems like a long way. I should get going. Alright. Anything else here? Let's go to Flint's Trail. <clears throat> Aid to block. Probably would have been a better place to end because it's probably going to cut to Amber now. Oh. What? What the hell? Can I click on anything else in the Mugshot Brothers? <coughs> Low lives, I guess. <laughs> Can you hear me? <clears throat> what the fuck? Whoa there. What's that? Is that is it expanding? <laughs> what the hell? <clears throat> What's happening to the room? Why is all the stuff disappearing? What the hell? I need to get out of here. What the fuck is happening? Whoa, it's in color. What the fuck? Some famous painter once said, when I don't have red, I use blue. What does that even mean? Is it just conventions flying out the window? Or is it a form of compromise? Until now, I thought the colors were pretty straightforward. Sun is yellow, sky is blue, and so on. But then again, I was never much of an artist. That's Amber's thing. What happens when all the colors come crashing down on you, like the world's most colorful tidal wave? I have no idea what I just witnessed. The violent, abrupt clashing of what can only be described as different realities. Ones that can't coexist in the same space. I was never a superstitious man. I value logic and reason above all things, none of which I found in there. Flint's room is not his room anymore, it's just a storage. I was there before. I saw his room. Didn't I? What's going on? The mugshot boys. What happened to them? They seemed dead, but somehow still alive. It's like they got caught somewhere in between Paper City and the other reality. Not quite dead, but not alive either. I'm positive whatever the hell that was in there, I would suffer the same fate as those two lowlifes had I decided to stay a bit longer. I can't grasp any of this anymore. I'm missing something, a key component. How is all of this connected? What am I not seeing here? I have to get to Amber. I need to get her away from Mills before he hands her over to Red. With Locke and PCPD on his side, that won't be an easy task, though. And I have to be prepared for anything. I have to find her and tell her what I found out. Maybe she can make sense of all this. B told me to follow the sea bulls, and I would find Amber. Any other day, I'd call him crazy and tell him to go home and rest, but not today. I have a bad feeling about the outcome of tonight's events, but I have no choice. I have to keep on. I have to finish this, despite all odds. What the fuck is happening? I'm done following logic, as it didn't bring me anywhere so far. It's time to sacrifice my principles at the altar of greater good and follow my gut on this one. Mm -hmm. In other words, if I don't have red, I'll <laughs> use blue instead. Whatever the hell that means. Okay. So we get to play Amber now, or are we still with Ted? I guess we're still with Ted. Is there... Uh, 
guess we're going to the skyscraper. Check Tigran's lair Tucky in the one. harbor. I mean, did you see it? I don't know what I saw, B. How's you your investigation going? Regarding the kid. I'm completely lost here, B. I need to get to the doll. Maybe she can make some sense out of all this, but first things first. <clears throat> what things? We need to get to her, B. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Don't worry, Snoop. <laughs> Any news from the rest of the breakfast club? No, but I trust they'll pull through on their end. I can't believe you were right about the damn seagulls, you nut. What's the deal with that? I told you, Bear. The gulls are just a means. Mills paid off someone to train them. They're carrying recording devices on them. It's how that pig keeps everything in check. God damn it. Keep your voice down. I mean, <laughs> it's not surprising. Information is power, Snoop. All of this is insane, B. It's like some cheesy crime drama. Yeah, and you know how those things end for guys like us, right? Huh. Perish the thought, buddy. And hope we don't perish with it. All right. I'll take care of the mustache club by the entrance. <laughs> you take care of the one patrolling on the right. Wait. What do you mean, take care of him? You know, take him out. That's an armed policeman. And you're an armed, <laughs> desperate man. Which one of you do you think has the upper hand? I'm not going to shoot the man, B. Who said anything about shooting? Use your wits. Craft something. Isn't that your thing? I... You might be confusing my life with that of MacGyver's. Just think of something. Sure, sure, whatever. Are you ready? I'm always ready. Let's do this thing. <laughs> what is even happening? Jeez. All right. Um... Paper City, then the main entrance. It's just the two of us. <laughs> we should look for an alternative entry point. Right. It's the cracked up Crusader. S CBG got him good. Indeed. Need help moving him? These walkies might come in handy. Indeed. It's just the. Nope. The CBG. You stay here. Make sure there's no more surprises. <laughs> If you see Red coming for her, try and stall him. Stall him? How? You know, craft something. Oh, I get it. Catch you later, and be careful. I have a feeling tomorrow's issue will be sold out. Probably. Anything else I can look at? I'll just grab one of these. What for? What the hell do you want to do with the newspaper? Can't have a construction site without it. Yeah, that's fair. He'll see me. I better keep my head down. That's an injury lawsuit if I ever saw one. Mm hmm Do I have to, like, sneak by him? I always wanted to drive one of these. Hmm. Looks like a good alternative route up. Indeed. Can I... I didn't get this? to the funnies yet. Oh, wait. Can I give one of these to see? Maybe I can use... Damn it. Maybe I can use it to bait that idiot over there. What? Put it here? Maybe I can use it to... I have to wait till he turns his back. Oh. Hmm. <clears throat> Seems like a good... Um... Maybe I can use it to... Maybe I can use it to bait... Or where? Can I get to the other side? I have to wait. He... I have to he... wait. I have to wait. Okay, um... I don't need Tom. Maybe I can use it. Seems like. Maybe I can use it. Fuck do I do? Let's see literally anything else. Maybe I can. He'll see.
Well, I got their walkie talkies. I have to wait till you. Yeah, no shit. I... His back I is to... turned. <sighs> I have to wait till you turn. Seems like a good idea, but something is missing. No time. Not sure. Not sure. I don't need. Maybe I can use it to. Maybe I can use it. I have to. His back is turned. I have to. Okay. Um. Maybe I can use. Maybe I can. Maybe I can. Maybe I can. Maybe I can. Well, let me use it on Ted. Seems like a. All right. What the fuck am I missing? <clears throat> You stay here. Stop. You know, oh, I'll catch you later. I have to wait till you. Literally will not let me go any further. I always wanted to. <sighs> okay. I have to wait. That's an injury lock. Um Maybe I can use it. Maybe I can I didn't get to the f I didn't get to Maybe there's something that like Tigrans that I can use. I don't know. I'm so confused. Why would it let me still go to Tigrans? Don't understand. Nothing to do here anymore. I better get down to the Westpaw Casino. I bet Amber went there to confront King. I have to hurry. All right, all right, all right, fine. Did they set me at the harbor? <clears throat> I'm so confused. I should. All right. After a. Alright, I guess I'll just set the skyscraper then. I don't know what the fuck else to do. What am I missing? It's always something. I need a rope here. I need some rope or something. Peace line. Need a newspaper to see BG. I didn't get to the. I didn't get. To I tried to do earlier. This is Wiley Coyote that. level of genius. Is 
who turns around. And here we go. Eagle calling dog. The chicken hit the floor. Over. What? That's an injury lawsuit if I ever saw one. <sighs> Poor dog. Okay. Well, at least that's over with. <coughs> it lets you mix the thing. Um, for the... Yep, that's what it is. Okay. Anything else over here? Or am I just gonna go upstairs? Just upstairs then. Alright. Up we go. How do I operate this? Here goes nothing. Indeed. <sighs> Should save. Oh. Maybe not. Hello. Look who decided to show up. It took you long enough. Oh, mm -hmm. were you waiting? My apologies. Oh, I see the doll got tangled up in some rope. I'm sure you don't mind if I... Tim. Son? Be smart about this. Oh, so you do mind. Come on now, Ted. Don't make me do something we'll both regret. I'm sorry, Sarge, but I came here to get my partner. And you know I won't leave without her. <laughs> you stop right there, Private. <coughs> God damn it, Ted. Don't force this on me. What happened to you, man? You weren't always this crooked. I'm not judging. I'm just curious. This city happened to me, Ted. It took me a while, but eventually I saw it. There is no right or wrong, you see. Nothing is black and white. It's rather gray. All of it. All the time. And that's coming from a cop. And, well, yes. A cop. You see, even a priest has to ask himself, eventually, is anyone really listening? What's your end game here? You know Red will probably kill her. What happens to you then? To all of us? I don't think it will come to that. See, besides... In her recent absence, <coughs> we learned how to, well, exist, nonetheless. You're in denial about this. Without her, there's nothing. Besides, don't you care about her? What will happen to her? I have a city to protect there. One girl against a million. Now, I'm not a mathematician, but... You'll never get away with this. Oh, I will. I'll get away with it. You see, I'm the commissioner. You really are a piece of work, you know that. I mean, Mills, I can understand. He has no redeeming qualities whatsoever. But you were a goddamn good man once. Dead, son. Be reasonable about this. No, no, no need for anyone to get hurt. Spare me the public speech, will you? You know he's going to kill her. Anyways, the jig is up. King provided me with enough evidence to put you two clowns away for good. King? Come on, Ted. The King's no longer of anyone's concern. Yeah, you took care of that. If you weren't so full of yourself, you would sweep his house a bit better. There were a lot of things you overlooked. Is this... Will this be a problem? He's bluffing, Daniel. It's what he does. Anyways, I'd love to chit-chat some more. But the doll looks uncomfortable, if you don't mind. Ted, stop! Ted, <sighs> listen to them! Please! Don't worry, doll. It would be low, even for them, to shoot an unarmed man. Oh, or shit. not... Ted! Whoa. Such the fuck? Such power. Incredible. You and him, you're made from the same cloth, girl. You! How can you let this happen? Please don't kill me. Please. I, I'm just a, I'm just a humble public servant. Please, girl. I'm not going to. I'm not a... Oh, my God, Ted! <sighs> Damn. Hey there, doll. <laughs> I, uh, I leave you for like a minute and see what happens. Oh, shut up, Ted. You had every right to leave me. I was acting like a child. Well, you are ten. Don't talk. The medics are on the way. No, no, oh, listen, listen, I have to tell you something. You'll tell me later, okay? Listen, I, <clears throat> I went to Flint's room. I used the same tunnel as those <laughs> lifes. You went back to the house? Doll, Flint's, Flint's room. It... <laughs> It wasn't there. I mean, it, it was, but it, it disappeared. What do you mean? 
Ted, you're hurt. <coughs> listen, listen to me this one time. God damn it. It's not just there. This room is just a, just a storage. I mean, it turned into a storage before my eyes. It's, it's like he was never there. I can't explain it to all. I, I have no idea what the hell is going on here. But I know one, one thing. You have to end this. This is, this is all, all about you. It was always about you. <laughs> you, you have to face that red bastard doll alone. I'm afraid. You, really? Ted, please. I can't do this without you. It's, it's the only way, Amber. You... Doll, I'm really sorry I left you like that. It was totally, totally out of character. I should have known better. <laughs> oh, shut up, please. It was all my fault. Everything. I shouldn't have eaten that cookie. Nothing's your fault. Life is just unfair sometimes, Doll, and... You'll have plenty of time to feel bad about it when you grow up. You shouldn't be so hard on yourself. The, uh, the weight of the world is not on you. Try to remember that. I'm sure <sighs> you'll be a great actress one day, or an artist, or whatever you end up doing. You'll be great at anything. <laughs> Ted, please don't leave me. Please don't leave me again. I can't do this without you. Sure. <clears throat> sure. Sure you can. The talk we had recently made it very clear. I was being hurtful on purpose. I don't believe that. But it's the truth. I got old, Amber. I made a promise. Some time ago, I would keep you safe. A promise? At first, I didn't even like you. <laughs> you were loud and <laughs> would always drag me around by the foot. And you were too damn cheerful for my taste. <laughs> you were always so grumpy. I honestly thought it would never work. I'm... I'm really glad I had to make that promise because I got to know you. I got to watch you grow up and you became my best friend and the best damn partner I could have asked for. Don't. You gave this old bear a purpose and I'm really grateful for that. And all I have to say in the end is that I'm really proud of you, doll. And I'm really lucky to have been a part of your life. Ted. God damn it. No! No, don't die! Ted! Ted, come back! Come back, please! Ted, come back! Mr. Mayor, you're... Under arrest, sir. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. Oh, what have I done? I'm on the episode there, so thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode of whatever I decide to make. Internet signing out. Bye.